Yeah, Ed Barry with the Sustainable World Initiative. I'd like to ask a quick question about a global, a broader global perspective. And that is, and, and I'm reading just a couple sentences leading into it. In 2011, the U.S. dumped almost 7 billion tons of greenhouse gases into the global atmosphere, but sequestered less than 1 billion tons from that same globally shared biosphere. These figures alone make it clear that the U.S. is one of the world's most egregious net CO2 polluters and that our national economy is markedly out of balance with our domestic capacity to assimilate CO2. And, and laws in the U.S. and throughout the world make it illegal for civilized humans to be harming or killing each other. Uh, and yet we know that global warming is putting life at risk, is taking away future generation opportunity. So my question is, why aren't we also framing this issue in terms of ethical principles, just right and wrong, uh, and, and from a human rights perspective? Thanks. Let me just, uh, obviously we were talking about the legalities and the implications of this rule. But I would suggest that in the public arena, there are clearly many voices who do frame it in those. But uh, you, you, the law is not written to uh, necessarily implement a system of ethics. It is a system of rules. And so that's why our focus is that today, it seems to me. But uh, and I'm sorry, we have uh, such short time. We have so many good questions from the Internet. And I know we have standing, but let's try to quickly take a, another one or two. For